Today it's Tuesday the 5th so the time is 8 23 right now so I'm in the process of getting ready for my first day oh my gosh as a program manager today's my first day for my new on my new job if you watch my last vlog then you know my huge announcement that I had was that I got a new job so I'll be working as a program manager and I'm just so proud of myself like this is a surreal moment and yes yeah, so I just felt like I would just take you guys through pretty much like you know my first work week or at least like a first like my first few days as y'all can see right now I know I'm not looking like I'm about to start my first day at work but first of all if you look at this top I ordered this top this set is from Shein by the way I ordered this set because this gives me very much like lounge and it gives me not super casual up top but then the bottom is shorts but nobody's gonna ever see my shorts so it's okay right so I'm about to throw some brows on real quick let me even show you guys my set this is the set so freaking cute and cozy my time is ticking my time is ticking so I'm about to put these brows on and we're gonna get started so welcome to the vlog like Okay guys, so that was probably the fastest orientation day I think I've ever had. We were in there for 20 minutes. <laughs> And I'm on an hour break now. So I'm like, cool, fine with me. So what I'm basically about to do now, so we use Slack to communicate. I'm sure some of you guys have probably heard of Slack. If you haven't, basically, almost like an app for like group chat, but it has like different channels. I'm about to just get familiar with Slack and I'm gonna just take this hour to just, I have like a ton of DMs. Like y'all, well, I have a ton of DMs on Slack. Everybody is so welcoming. Like everybody is very warm. Like this is the, y'all know my energy, okay? Like I'm a very warm and bubbly person. I'm very excited, okay? Like this is the energy that I need and yeah so as you guys probably saw in the beginning I made some juice like some fresh pressed juice with my juicer I don't even know if you guys have ever even seen me use my juicer before so this is a green juice this is kale spinach cucumber pineapple ginger and that's it now my only concern with this is that it has not been in the fridge that long Okay, it's better than I expected, it's better than I expected, but it would taste a lot better cold. So I'm gonna maybe drink like half of this, but then I, I'm gonna probably put it in the fridge. I decided to make this juice because I think I told you guys in either the last vlog or a couple vlogs ago, but I have been just eating crappy food. Like I've been drinking a bunch of processed juice, like ice cream, just all this stuff. Like don't get me wrong, these things are okay every now and again, but for my body, I feel like I'm kind of at a point where it's like, what's your excuse? Like I've been out of school for for over a month now like we're legit in July I have not stepped foot in anybody's gym or done anybody's workout in a long time what are you doing like what are you actually doing I can just tell in my face that like I've gained weight and now that I'm starting this new job I really just wanted to walk into my first week with a very like fresh and clean mind so the other juice that I made it's like carrots peaches pineapple I think I might have put some green apple and then ginger and I think that's it so let's just talk a little bit more about my role guys so like I said I am gonna be a program manager and I work for a startup tech company so I'm just super excited about it everybody was just bubbly like my team seems like they are just a lot of fun so I just have like some onboarding stuff to go over like on my own and now that I have this break I'll probably do that they sent us a weekly playlist how cute is this something on Spotify and I feel like they added all of our like favorite songs to it because last week they reached out and asked me what are like one to three of my favorite songs so this is just so cute y'all like I love it if you work for an agency that's like at home that it's really important that you do things to keep the culture
culture very like close and you know to kind of like do little things to keep people like closely knit because these aren't things that you can do obviously remote versus if you were in person y'all talk every day so y'all will be able to like you know do company parties and potlucks and random little you know lunches together but we can't really do that when we're remote and so anyway that's why I'm excited because so far it seems like the company does a really good job as far as like cultivating that culture and making people feel like really together so that's pretty much it so what I'm gonna do is just you know kind of breeze through my day and I'll be checking in with you guys just to let y'all know how everything is going but so far so good like I said I'm feeling good I'm excited I'm so blessed and grateful to God that I got this role oh my goodness y'all like I like I get a MacBook computer it hasn't come in just yet but I just cannot wait hopefully it'll come in this week so I can unbox it with y'all Hey y'all, so I'm sure that you guys were not expecting me to be in the car, right? I know, me either. Definitely got my hair up in this real like crazy looking ponytail. I decided to come to Target because I was about to make my lunch and I realized I ran out of one of the most intricate ingredients, which is chickpeas. So, so I need to run in here to get some chickpeas. So while I'm out, I'm also going to run to UPS because I have a um, Shein return. I need to send some stuff back. so it's after my work day I'm finished for the day I finished around um, 345 it's the end of the day the time is 618 so yeah so anyway I'm actually about to have like an early dinner probably gonna eat again before the night is over I'm not gonna lie so I'm actually having a chopped salad let me show y'all this is my very green chopped salad I cannot wait to get into this and then if y'all know me at this point you know that LaCroix is really my favorite so this is the limoncello flavor I think I put y'all onto this a while ago y'all this one literally tastes like lemon vanilla pound cake it's so 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 good um, so if you're in the market for a new sparkling water flavor she's that girl 
So yeah guys, day two went really good for my for my new role. Today I was able to get more into the specifics of what I'll be doing with my particular program. So I got to meet a lot of my like direct teammates that I'm gonna be working with. I actually got to talk to my direct supervisor today. It was real chill, like another chill day. Like, you know, we did some meet and greets where I got to, you know, just get to know some of my other team members. And what I really love about this company is that it's just, it's just such a vibe, y'all. Like everybody just has very positive energy. Everybody's very welcoming. Me. They've been answering all my questions. I've also just been getting more familiar with like the um, software that we use. So I'm getting warmer and warmer. I haven't done any like official program management stuff just yet. And then also I found out that one of my high school classmates also works for the company. So I've been talking to her. She's been giving me all the tea, all the rundown, but she loves it. So it's not like bad tea, it's good tea, y'all. So I decided to switch up the angle for y'all because I felt like I've been sitting in that chair for like the last two days. First of all, I underestimated that salad. And then I also just realized that I didn't give y'all the tea on what all was in there. But let me know if you want like a recipe video because I'm about to be going crazy on the salads, okay? Not because I believe that you can only eat salads when you're trying to eat healthy because I that's the furthest from what I actually believe. I just feel like I make really bomb salads, so. Today was a really good day. I got to learn more about my role in particular. So I think that's what the rest of my week is probably gonna consist of. Sorry y'all, I keep moving. Learning about my role specifically. This is the lounge set that we decided to wear today, y'all. It's very cozy. There are no armholes. It's just more of like a drape, like it literally drapes over my shoulders. So yeah guys, it's the end of day two. I am not done for the day, not exactly. I don't know if I've shared this yet, but I'm also a volunteer project coordinator for a program that I've from it's a leadership program to have like a a bi-weekly update meeting and so basically my role as a project coordinator is to pretty much oversee a six month long project that's going on right now so tonight we're just like checking in with each other looking at the deliverables that are due Good morning y'all, happy Thursday. So today is day three of my first week as a program manager and I'm actually about to do some work for my previous job because I'm still in the process of transitioning out. So I actually have a training that's literally starting in like two minutes. So I'm about to hop on there, but I just wanted to start the day to say good morning. Also, I have some green juice here. I still have at least two good glasses left and it's actually not bad. Like in the morning, I feel like it's just very refreshing. So I really been enjoying that yesterday I tried the carrot juice and it was bomb and then I also have a nice cold berry banana smoothie which is also one of my favorite things so literally this is about 36 ounces of smoothie this typically holds me over for about three hours but anyway like I said I just wanted to start the vlog and I'm about to go ahead and get my meeting started so how was um, the rest of yesterday like after we checked in and everything Okay guys, so it is nighttime now. I was supposed to do this haul for you guys earlier, but obviously I was working and I just didn't feel like doing it at the time. I have successfully completed day three of my week as a program manager. So I wanted to do this quick Target haul for you guys since it is like somewhat related, like the items that I got are somewhat related to my job and some of them are just random things, so yeah. The first thing that I got is this um, stainless steel bowl. And I mainly got this because um, if you guys remember the salad that I showed y'all yesterday. This is what I used to chop that salad. I got this from Amazon. I'll link it below just in case you guys will want to purchase your own. But this is pretty much the type of chopper that they use in like your favorite salad shop. I used a plastic bowl to chop my salad yesterday. <laughs> so they said that a stainless steel bowl works better. So that's what I got from Target. The next thing I got was I got a new drinking cup. It's like a, it has three different ways to drink in one. So this is what the top of it looks like. And I'm not super crazy about this color but it'll do, I guess. I like blush pink, don't get me wrong, but I prefer a different type of blush pink, but this one is still cute. And this is, I think, 34 ounces. Let me see. Yeah, this is 34 ounces. So literally three of these a day, and I'll be at my water intake amount for the day. The next thing I got, meal plan tracker. I don't really do that good with stuff like this. I'm gonna be honest. Like, I, like I'll like i start and then something will happen and I'll fall off and I won't stick to it. So I got this from Target. I paid like $8 for it. So hopefully y'all can see the writing. 
up closer. So I really want to plan to like use this to plan out my meals. So then I also got this notebook also from Target. This was probably like $8. I am currently taking a, um, I'm taking Google's project management certification course and I really want a notebook specifically for my project management stuff. So I felt like I wanted to just buy this book to take my note or anything related to project management is going to go inside of her. Okay. Last but not least in the hall, I got another cute notebook because why not? I'm about to run out of the pages in the one that I have in my office. So I felt like it was just time to get a new one. I also got two bags of frozen fruit, but I mean, do y'all really wanna see that? With that, I think I'm gonna go ahead and end the video, guys. I'm gonna end the vlog here. Like overall, we just gonna go on and end it. I'm curious to see how you guys like this type of video with me doing like the program manager in my life. Maybe I will do like just one vlog as like a full day in my life as a program manager. Like your first week on a new job is really just gonna be a bunch of like paperwork, onboarding, like getting to know your team and stuff. So I didn't really get into like the meat of my work this week. I did learn a whole lot more about who I'm gonna be working with. So today I got to meet our operations manager, our recruiting manager, and then I'm also gonna be working hand in hand with some of our career coaches. If you wanna see more content like this of me showing you guys like what my job is like as a program manager, make sure you let me know. Make sure y'all watch the vlogs, all right? I think I said this in my last video. I don't know which one is gonna come out first, but make sure you are watching the vlogs. I did a poll on my um, community tab asking you guys what videos y'all want to see more of. And most of you guys said vlogs, so I need y'all to watch the vlogs. We need to run that watch time up. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. I enjoyed filming it for y'all this week and I will see you in my next one.